to say late junior year, early senior year of high school, I have like old notebooks that I've saved where you can see the name Acumen being like made into a logo on the front, you know, scribbling it out. And then Jason called me up and he goes, this should be a band. We should like do something with this. This is Jim Nash from Wax Trax. We don't usually talk to anybody about unsolicited demos or anything, blah, 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 but this Acumen cassette has been um, playing in the office now for the last day and we really like what you're doing. Walked into Metro and I was like, who are these guys? Who is this band? Who are these guys? I was like, they're like going to be famous one day. It's the greatest band in the whole world. A month later, this guy comes back, this high-powered lawyer, and tells our friend, I have some bad news, they kind of got you. They have actual copyright about six months before you ever copyrighted anything or released anything. He had basically thrown down the gauntlet saying like, either I'm going to leave the band or Ethan's going to leave the band. And this gets even, the story gets even way crazier. And I look up and there's nothing on the roof. The racks are gone, all our shit's gone, all our personal bags, the drum hardware, it's gone. The dumpster in our fucking building is filled with with like cases of your CDs. You never think the last time you get like a, a Facebook message from him or the last time you like drive him home after a show that's gonna be the last time you see him. And I was really taken by instantly thinking Jamie Jamie's dead and I, I was like we have to do something his mother needs some help we need to put something together so people can come and mourn and be together he was a glue to a lot of this music he held a lot of these bands friendships together because he was the agreeable fun knew how to do it badass you know it goes to show that this whole scene is a family you know as, as tough as the music is and as scary as we all look sometimes we're the nicest people you're ever going to meet